good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you may be. Um, so as I just did a reaction to the new Indiana Jones trailer, uh, as I said this morning, you know, I was looking at my Disney Plus to, uh, you know, as I'm doing my budget and whatnot, and I see the um, like ca place card, if that's what you call it or whatever, for Ahsoka. And I'm like, wait a minute, they're putting this stuff, is there a trailer? And lo and behold, there is. So we have our first teaser trailer for Ahsoka. Um, like I said, uh, love the Mandalorian, which she was induced, uh, introduced in last season. Boba Fett was, eh. Um, loved Andor. So, you know, like I said, Star Wars, in my opinion, is doing good. Live action and animation. You know, Bad Batch is it's okay. Um, so, yeah, let's go ahead and see what we have in store for Ahsoka. Doo -doo -doo. And, oops. and here. We go. Something's coming. Something dark. I sense it. I like the red. This is a new beginning. Sabine? For some, the most cat war. Hera, suffer. Power. It's been a while. Things have changed. Okay. I started hearing whispers. About Thrawn's return. Admiral As heir to the Empire. <laughs> we have to prepare for the worst. The Jedi fell a long time ago. There aren't many left. It is time to begin again. <laughs> Thank you, Disney Plus. Thank you, Lucasfilm. <laughs> wow. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to go back through and watch that a number of times. You know what? Actually, um, okay, let's see. Du -du 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 -du. So we have a token that looks very much like a Jedi temple ruin. So <laughs> we have a little cat. And so we have our live action Sab Sabine Wren. I see that she's, they, they grew her hair out for this. Hera. Uh, where was that first little thing? Oh, let's see. What was that first shot? Was Whoa. okay. So we have our Hera. We have Chopper. <laughs> now, who is this? I'm trying to think. Am I forgetting? I mean, is this a character from Rebels that I'm forgetting? I don't think so. And. Obviously, red. Well, it looks more orange than red. Blade. Um, the ship uh, and, and X-Wing. So, this scene here feels very reminiscent of the uh, very end of Rebels. When Ahsoka returns. Of course, let's see. I guess members of the New Republic. Well, let's see again. Because, again, depending on where this is, I don't know if this is supposed to be a flashback scene or current day. Uh, 
hearing whispers. Yeah, that's Genevieve O'Reilly. Okay, for Mon Mothma. And we have our Admiral Thrawn. I mean, we don't get a good look at him yet, but yeah. And who is this? Hmm. Again, it looks orange um, instead of red, so I don't know if that's a color issue or it is supposed to actually be orange, which as I think about it, I don't know if I've ever seen in context an orange lightsaber. Uh, but like I said, or if it is supposed to be red, but color issues. But yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, yeah. <laughs> uh, so oh, <laughs> I, I'm sorry. Ob obviously, you you can see I'm happy, <laughs> very happy. Um, that's that's. That's all I, I, I really could say. Now, again, like I said, I really enjoyed uh, Rebels, the animated series. And, you know, as a lot of people said, Ahsoka kind of seems like it's uh, Rebels 2.0, basically. Which, I mean, yeah, you could maybe think of it that way. Kind of like, uh, again, Captain America Civil War was really Avengers 2.0, <laughs> if you think about it. But it was still a Captain America movie. So, you know, hopefully this series, even though we're basically getting the Rebels crew back, and a continuation, except for we, you know, we saw Zeb in um, Mandalorian uh, last week. Um, you know, maybe, like I said, hopefully, I mean, it, we're we're getting uh, the, the 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 crew of the Ghost from Rebels, um, and um, you know, but it'll still be very much an Ahsoka story. I mean, even though, again, as when when she was introduced in Mandalorian Season 2, you know, because she was looking for Thrawn and hence Ezra. Uh, so yeah, I, I'm just I, I'm just excited. I'm excited to see them all in live action. Uh, just, just to see. And again, like I said, I, you know, again, Star Wars is having, it, it has, it, like all stories, all things, uh, series, it has its ups and downs. Uh, like I said, again, Mandalorian in general, I love you know, there have been a couple episodes that have been here. There have been like, and for the most part, I've loved all all the Mandalorians so far. Um, Ninety four, say nine percent of the Mandalorians so far. You know, Boba Fett was, eh. You know, I gave it a D minus C as a series. Uh, of course, the best episodes of that, honestly, were the Mandalorian episodes. Um, you know, again, uh, I I loved Andor. Just that look. Uh, as far as Star Wars, I mean, as far as Star Wars. So, yeah, I am glad we are just getting some great Star Wars stuff on TV. Maybe they'll get there uh, straight as far as movies one of these days. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, it's it's a great time to be a Star Wars fan, which I believe Celebration, is it this week that it's going on? I'm not sure. I mean, I know it's in the UK. But, uh, anyways, I'm going to stop babbling. As always... Feel free to share, subscribe, hopefully give me a like. If you like my content, um, my, my brain is gone. <laughs> so uh, if you do subscribe, feel free to hit that little bell notification icon so you know when I do drop new content, as sporadic as it may be. And feel free to leave a comment below. Let me know what you think of the teaser trailer for Ahsoka, my reaction, or just anything in general you want to hear me wax rep rhapsodic about. Uh, so as always, thanks for watching.